afternoon, Wash. Today is Friday, January 4th, a B-Day, regular schedule, and today we are so excited to bring you lines from a bucket that it just wants to make us shout, let's hug it out. No. No, no, no. 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 Uh, yeah, I feel you. I'm so excited about our improvisational script today because you just never know what could come out of my mouth next. I mean, I could say anything like, can it, Oh boy. Can anyone find my pants? They've been missing since Tuesday. Good thing there's a table stuck here. I, I you was know? thinking the same thing, yep. Or I could say, I'm about to go to level 90 on you. Is that like a Fortnite thing? I don't, I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't sound good though. No. All right, so don't do that, not right now. Okay. okay. Those are all very good points, but we need to get on to our announcements. I know what you're thinking. We are going to rock your faces off. You know that's what everyone's that's thinking. That's what the Eagles are going to do to the Bears. Oh, that's on right. Sunday. Yes. Yay. We have a lot of Bear fans around here, though. They're well, fine. I have happy. the whole entire list. Oh, of do them. you? Oh, that's a big Haley list. Haley McDowell, Mrs. Luffelholtz, Mr. Real, Miss Smellis, and my grandma, Miss Stuckline. Oh, nice. There's only a few. The rest are Packer fans. Okay, that's But good. on Sunday, we're all Eagle fans. Yes, exactly. I know you're thinking you want to work on the crew for Suzical. I have to because I didn't get a part. I wanted Maisie the Bird. Remember you, that? Yeah, and no, I didn't you get didn't it. get it because guess who got it? That. Who? Did you really? Mm -hmm. I'm going to be awesome. Don't forget to mark in your calendars the informational meeting for the crew of Suzical on Wednesday, January 23rd from 2.30 to 3 p.m. in the auditorium. Just write it next to the note reminding you that I don't care that you broke your elbow. That's not showing your wash values. No. Here's another great reminder to wear your ID. If you've misplaced yours over the long break when you were watching movies like the one titled, oh, this could be, like that time the fire alarm went off before first period, do you remember that? They made that into a movie? I bet that would be an Oscar winning movie. Um, or my favorite movie, I'm pretty sure climbing into the tiger pen at the zoo is a poor choice. Yes, it is. Uh, that movie didn't end well, I don't think. <laughs> no, it remember. didn't. It was a little gory. Yeah. Uh, so just go in and say, oh my goodness, cat puns really freak meow. <laughs> uh, and they'll fix you right up. It's weird. It's weird. Really weird. I wonder who wrote these. Yeah, I don't know. When you're there, you can also turn in your, your order form and money for your band t-shirt if you already, already haven't done it because the deadline is January 10th. They are awesome tie-dye t-shirts. Have you seen them? They're pretty yeah, cool. Do you I see what they like say them. on the back of them? Uh, no. Oh, do you know what Yeah, I think say? they say, good gravy. I love mashed potatoes. For, <laughs> that is. I don't think that's what they say. No one would buy them if they said that. That's true. Okay. Um, I'm pretty sure that they will say band is a blast and they represent our band of zeal. Music is awesome. And you know what they say about music? That's a little, I should be scared. Grapes are raisins, but younger. I don't think I've ever heard them say that about music. I don't either. But maybe. Maybe. You know, that is why they... I they're talking about like the Rolling Stones. But I bet our kids don't even know yeah. who the Rolling Stones are. Like Jager, yeah, probably you know. not. And wrinkled. speaking of music, the orchestra is selling tickets for the Fighting Saints game on Friday, February 1st. Order forms are available from Mrs. Mentz in the orchestra room. It should be a fun time. Don't forget to cheer, saying things like, you're only as good as your last haircut. Hey, uh, <laughs> why do I always get the ones about hair in here? I think these are rigged. I think you need to get a toupee. Oh, and you know what they always say, you're, you're doing just, too much. That's a compliment. That, oh, it is? That yeah, is that true. means you're doing... Extra. No one ever that tells, no one ever you tells me that. You went above and beyond. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Those are great cheers. Now, please consider donating some boxes of tissue. When you don't have tissue, your nose usually screams. Oh, boy. The early bird can have the worm because the worms are gross and the mornings are stupid. And sometimes boogers when they're coming. Yeah. Never mind. <laughs> don't go um, there. And many of your classrooms have no tissues left for their screaming noses. No one wants to see worms coming out of a nose. Now, let's not forget the birthdays today. When you see Caleb Ludovici, Kaylee Pyle Anderson, and Henry Raber today, make sure to say, the Fortnite store is trash today. <laughs> Do you play a lot of a break? I have no idea what that means. <laughs> But also, don't forget to show some love to Leah Simmons and Kyron Jurisic as they celebrate their birthdays this weekend. 
Oh yeah, I forgot to mention some very special Wahawks who solid celebrated over break. We apologize greatly to Elias Matthews, Alex Bodie, and Andrew Jester for accidentally omitting your names from the birthday slides. We were punishing ourselves by constantly yelling. Adulting is hard over and over again until we feel like we can forgive ourselves. But seriously, happy birthday, folks. And now we must give a shout out to these great Wahawks who came to school thinking This time yesterday, I was stuck in a well. Like baby Jessica? I think so. <laughs> I think so. Or there's an episode of Little House on the Prairie like that, too. Yeah. Remember that? That was awesome. I think you're aging yourself. I think so, too. And then show their wash values so that teachers exclaim, oh, there's another one. Oh, that's the long one. If you want to teach people about taxes, just eat 30% of their ice cream. You should never eat someone else's ice yeah, cream. Yeah, that's true. That's like... The mortal Yeah, city. that's horrible. And give them stickers, and then they win the values drawing. So congratulations to Kira Harvansik, Harvansik, sorry, Kira, Izzy Murdaugh, and Shayna Diaz. Alex Croft, Refrigerator Perry, Quinn Spawn, Jim McMahon, Ella, uh, Jack Kaufman, and Sweetness Walter... Um, <clears throat> well, I guess that's it for today. Except to tell you our very, you to tell you our very serious and important thought of the day that will inspire you for the rest of the day. The day, and that is, Eagles win. Sorry, Bears fans. <laughs> Have a whimsical, whimsical day, day, Wash. wash.